Hi, we're the Beekuses, and we're going to be doing day six of the devotional, starting with Isaiah 40, verses 27 through 31. Why do you complain, Jacob? Why do you say, Israel, my way is hidden from the Lord, my cause is disregarded by my God? Do you not know? Have you not heard? The Lord is the everlasting God, the creator of the ends of the earth. He will not grow tired or weary, and his understanding no one can fathom. He gives strength to the weary and increases the power of the weak. Even youths grow tired and weary, and young men stumble and fall. But those who hope in the Lord will renew their strength. They will soar on wings like eagles. They will run and not grow weary, and they will walk and not be faint. This is a beautiful word from God, reminding us that he is always about saving us. Whether we're under the captivity of sin or have wandered in exile from him, he is always there to comfort and restore us. We only need to wait on the Lord. I think that means a lot of things, but I think of trusting, being still, open, and receptive, even clinging desperately to him. What other ways could you wait on the Lord? See the contrast in Isaiah? God, who never grows tired or weary, will give strength to the weak and power to the weary. Echoing these words, Jesus says, Come to me, all who are weary, and I will give you rest. Rest which renews our strength. Going back to our passage in Isaiah, notice how God unfolds what it means to be renewed in strength. The images of flying, running, walking, are giving. All of these are movements from something to something, from captivity to freedom, from darkness to light, from death to life. The crucified and risen Christ has come to lead us in that movement, and he calls out, come follow me, but tells us that to follow him, we must deny ourselves and take up our cross. But how do we have the strength to bear our crosses when we are weak and so often fail? This brings us full circle to his words in Isaiah, he will renew your strength. Um, thank you so much for letting us speak to you guys at uh, our Foundry family. Um, we miss you. We look forward to seeing you all soon. And um, we'll be praying for all of you guys for a safe and, and healthy week. Thanks. All right. Thanks. Bye. Bye-bye.